But what's interesting, even if we take this philosophy of treat them how they want to be treated, we also, also respect uh, in return that that person treats you how you want to be treated. And it's a fine balance sometimes because if we just keep giving and positioning everything around how other people want to be treated, we might forget about ourselves. So we do need to take some time to treat yourself how you want to be treated. Kia ora, hi, I'm Craig Johns, high performance leadership expert, CEO and managing partner of Speakers Institute Corporate, and the founder of Gravity of Leadership. On today's episode of the Gravity of Leadership series, we're talking about treat people how they want to be treated. Now we've quite often heard the term treat people how you would like to be treated, but we're so unique. Everyone's very, very different. Everyone has different needs, different wants, uh, different areas of significance or different ways of significance in their life. And so if we want to bring the best out of people, we need to treat them how they want to be treated. So understand, how do they want to be addressed? What drives them? Do they want to be empowered? Do they want to be led more? What is it that fuels them to bring out their best? But what's interesting, even if we take this philosophy of treat them how they want to be treated, we also, also respect uh, in return that that person treats you how you want to be treated. And it's a fine balance sometimes because if we just keep giving and positioning everything around how other people want to be treated, we might forget about ourselves. So we do need to take some time to treat yourself how you want to be treated not how you think other people want you to behave or act or interact. So it's a fine balance. But in the end, if we want to create more inclusive environments, we do need to make sure that we treat people how they want to be treated. And that could be in the pronouns they use. That could be some like to be micromanaged. Some like to be empowered to be left alone. Some like to joke around and have a lot of fun, whereas others like to be a bit more serious. Some like to be visual learners. Some like to be auditory learners. Some like to read more. Some like to be kinesthetic and do things. So we need to understand our people. Because people aren't our greatest assets. They are our greatest priorities. So take the time to think about how you can treat people how they want to be treated. And if you don't understand, then spend some time with them, asking them what environment and what brings the best out of them and how can you help. Remember, it's important to create a gravitational pull, not a gravitational push as a leader. What is your gravity of leadership today? Ka kite anō. I'll see you next time.